Uh, look at, you know, L.A. They got Mayor Garcetti. I love L.A. I love Southern, Southern California. Um, I got a lot of friends and family out there. I might even get a house out there. But I'm not a crazy, I'm not too crazy of a fan of how they just let folks put all their tents and shit all on the sidewalk. You know how that happened? So it used to be in L.A., it used to be that if you had your little tent and shit all on the sidewalk and stuff, the cops had the right to come and... Oh, right. They revoked that, right? You couldn't do that anymore. The ACLU came yeah. in. Yeah. The ACLU came in and said, hey, you're violating people's uh, civil liberties right. and stuff, and that's someone's property on city property, and you can't... You, Mr. Police Officer, you can't go over there and tell people to move around and kick them out and throw their shit away. Right. And tell them, hey, man, get the fuck out of here. This is city property. You can't. This is not your house. We on the corner of Vine. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And um, so the ACLU and the lawsuits, the lawyers, y'all's leaders came in and made it to where, fuck it. You could you could post up under every single underpass. While they're at it, they want to defund the police. They already did. They go murders and crime rate going up. When you defund the police, you're not taking it away from the private communities that have their own private police, like here in Houston, you got was Spring Valley mm-hmm. and you know your River Oaks, all um, all these people in these little areas where it's like, man, slow down, man. These cops don't play. Yeah. This ain't HPD. Right. This is not Houston Police Department. This is their own shit. So when you defund the police, when you fall for the okey doke, when you fall for the rhetoric of, hey man, you don't need all them guns. It's, fuck Second Amendment. We gonna take your guns while you at it. Defund the police. That way we could send a social worker if somebody's on Sherm, a PCP, they on that wet, and uh, they, they they dipping formaldehyde in the fucking, in the joint, and they hitting that hole, and they getting this excited delirium, now they running around butt naked with a knife, <laughs> and you want to send a social worker? Good luck calling 911. Um, you know, in Texas, we really don't call 911. But, uh, but you know what I'm saying? People, our so-called Latino leaders, they don't ever want to touch that. Yeah. They don't ever want to say, th- this is what they want to say. Latinos for Trump is like roaches for raid. Orale. 